Not to say that cats and dogs don't make excellent pets for people who love animals, but some people want animals with a wild streak. Animals are interesting creatures and humans are attracted to them. Currently, there are 8 million animals in the world and there is still another 80% left undiscovered. If you are thinking you'd break any laws having these animals mentioned here as pets, you should not worry as they are completely legal. Here are 10 exotic animals you can legally own as pets. Number 1. The Axolotl The Axolotl is a pedomorphic salamander related to the tiger salamander. They were found originally in several lakes such as Lake Xochimilco, underlying Mexico City. This animal reaches adulthood without undergoing metamorphosis, and instead of taking to land, the adults remain aquatic and gilled. In 2020, due to urbanization and water pollution, they almost went extinct. Their heads are wide and their eyes are lidless. Their limbs are underdeveloped and possess long, thin digits. The females are noticed by their wider bodies full of eggs. The adult axolotl requires a 20 gallon aquarium due to the large amount of waste they produce. They require minimal lighting and prefer the dark. They eat large earthworms and bloodworms and are legal to own everywhere in the United States except Maine, California, New Jersey, and Virginia. But it is a crime to import them from out of state. Number two, the sugar glider. The sugar glider is a small omnivorous, arboreal, and nocturnal gliding possum, which belongs to the marsupial infraclass. Its name, the sugar glider, is due to its love for sugary food, such as sap, nectar, and its ability to glide through the air, almost like a squirrel flying. The animal is covered in soft pale gray to light brown fur, with its counter shaded, being lighter on the underside. Gliding serves as a means of reaching food and avoiding predators. Like kangaroos, the females raise their young ones in pouches until they are mature. They love play dates with other animals and their caregivers. Their food consists of honey, nectar powder, water, and a hard-boiled egg. They are illegal to own in California and Alaska, but are legal with a permit in Massachusetts and Pennsylvania. Number three, the chinchilla. The chinchilla is a little larger and robust than ground squirrels and are native to the Andes Mountains in South America. They live in colonies called herds at high elevations. Historically, they lived in an area that is made up of Bolivia, Peru, Argentina, and Chile, but today's colonies can be found majorly in Chile. The chinchilla has the densest fur of all mammals that live on land. In their native habitat, they live in burrows and crevices in rocks. They are jumpers and can lift up to 1.8 meters. They eat leaves, fruits, and small insects. They are named after the Chincha people and are accustomed to warm weather and open spaces, which means they are active and energetic. They require lots of dental care because their teeth never stop growing. They are legal to own in most states such as North Dakota, California, Delaware, and Hawaii, and some states may require a permit. Number four, the hyacinth macaw. The hyacinth macaw is a parrot who is native to the central and eastern South America with a length of about a meter. It is longer than any other species of parrot. Loss of habitats and trapping of wild birds for pet trade have reduced their population, which makes them vulnerable. Their diet is majorly nuts from specific palm species. Their strong beaks is even able to crack coconuts, the large Brazil nut pods, and macadamia nuts, and also travel for the ripest fruits over a vast area. They make interactive house pets because they are vocal and comical, also known as blue parrots. It enjoys the company of others. However, 
Its largeness can be a handful, especially when it comes to care. Owners may have to shop for a custom-made cage and invest in vegetarian diets. These beds are expensive and their cost is between a grand and $10,000. They can be owned in the United States as long as they are not imported. Number five, the chimpanzee. For monkey lovers, the chimpanzee is an awesome pet to own. It is a species of the great ape and native to the forest and savanna of tropical Africa. The chimpanzee is covered in coarse black hair, but has a bare face, fingers, toes, palm of the hands and soles of the feet. They live in groups that range from 15 to 150 members. The biggest threats to the chimpanzees are disease, poaching and habitat loss. Chimpanzees lose more hair as they get older and develop bald spots. White or gray patches may appear on the chin and lower region. Those who wish to own them as pets need to invest in large enclosure for the animals to play in. They enjoy feeding on plants and vegetables. They are illegal to own in most states. The few states that allow ownership are Oklahoma, Rhode Island, North Dakota, and Pennsylvania. Number six, the wallaby. A wallaby is a small micro macropod that is native to Australia and New Guinea, with populations introduced in New Zealand, Hawaii, the United Kingdom, and other countries. They belong to the same family as kangaroos and sometimes the same genus. The head and body length is 45 to 105 centimeters, and the tail is 33 to 75 centimeters. One of the brush wallaby species is known as the dwarf wallaby, also native to Guinea. It is the smallest wallaby species and one of the smallest known macropods. Their strong hind legs are not only used for bounding at high speeds and jumping great heights, but also for kicks against predators. Affectionately, they are called mini kangaroos. They are herbivores, so they eat lots of vegetables and plants. Most states in the United States require a USDA license to be able to own a wallaby, but states that don't require the license are Ohio, Wisconsin, Nevada, West Virginia, and North and South Carolina. Number seven, the capybara. The capybara is a giant rodent native to South America. Its close relatives include guinea pigs and rock carvies and it is more related to the aguiti, the chinchilla, and the nutria. The capybara has its habitat in the savannas and dense forests, and it lives close to bodies of water. It is highly social and can be found in large groups of up to 100 individuals and not considered an endangered species. They are the largest rodents recorded in history and can be as tall as a golden retriever. They can be affectionate, but doesn't mean they are easy to look after, especially as pets. Skin care for the capybara is very important because they have an extremely dry skin and always need to be in water. They are legal in only two states in the United States, Texas and Pennsylvania. They have a heavy barrel shaped body and short head. The upper part of its body is made of reddish brown fur that turns yellowish brown under heat. Their hind legs are slightly longer than their forelegs. They have three toes on their rear feet and four toes on their front feet. Number eight, the fennec fox. The fennec fox is native to the Sahara Desert, the Sinai Peninsula of Egypt, the Arava and Negev deserts. Its most unique feature is its large ears, which help to dissipate heat. It is the smallest canid species, and its coat, ears, kidneys have adapted to the desert environment, and its ears help to hear preys that are underground. It eats insects, small mammals, and birds. They dig out burrows in the sand for habitation and protection. The nose of the fennec fox is black, and its fur is straw-colored. They make the ideal purse dog and can be taught to fetch and taken on walks. They also eat dog food, but occasionally require a side dish of crickets. 
They are legal to own in the United States, except the states of Missouri, Nevada, Minnesota, and Washington, D.C. Number nine, the bearded dragon. The bearded dragon lives up to its name. And like a dragon, it is equipped with an armor of spiny reptilian skills. It also has a beard of spike under its chin that puffs up depending on its mood. There are eight species of the bearded dragon. Bearded dragons are gentle, inquisitive, and active during the day. Bearded dragons as pets have needs that are easy to follow because they are omnivores and require sunlight and sand to show their natural habitats. They are quite popular as pets in the United States and are legal in most states. They are cold-blooded, so they rely on external heat to raise their body temperature, which varies according to the temperature of the environment. They can burrow underground to avoid extreme heats and predators. Bearded dragons communicate with each other by changing the color of their beards and bobbing their heads. A quick head bob is a sign of dominance, while a slow, calm bob is a sign of submission. Number 10, the Saval. This is a wild cat native to the continent of Africa, but rare in North Africa and the Sahel, but widespread in sub-Saharan countries except rainforest regions. Cat lovers will adore this wild beauty. Savals are accustomed to warm climates and open wide spaces. It is a solitary carnivore and active during the day and night. It preys on rodents, frogs, insects, small birds, and reptiles. It leaps over two meters above the ground to land on its prey and kills with a bite to the neck or head. Pet owners should build enough space for the Saval to feel at home. They require lots of exercise and love to play. They can also be litter trained, but you'd have to start early. They are legal to own in the United States in Texas, Nevada, South Carolina, Oklahoma, and Maine. It depends on the state you live in. It's important to check ahead of time. The Saval is known in Morocco and has been reintroduced in Tunisia but feared to have gone extinct in Algeria. Keeping exotic pets has risen in popularity as people look for new and different kinds of pets to own. Some may not be legal to where you live and have specific care and behavior that makes owning them quite difficult. That's it from us guys, and we'll see you in another video. Do you have any other animal you think will serve as a better pet? Kindly drop a comment below and don't forget to like, subscribe and share. See you in the next one.